More than 24 hours after an explosion in northwest Harris County, some people are finally able to return to their homes and repairs still underway. As we reported, a Comcast contractor hit a two-inch gas line. Centerpoint checked it out. Then they hit a six-inch line that sparked the fire. KPRC 2's Bill Barajas live from the scene. So, Bill, do we know the condition of the Centerpoint employees who were injured? Well, according to the Klein Fire Chief, five of them were rushed to the hospital by ambulance. Their conditions are unknown right now. A six was taken by Life Flight to Herman Hospital downtown. At last check, they were in critical but stable condition. Now, the scene out here, uh, as you mentioned, 24 hours later, much different than it was last night. I want to give you a look now. Uh, again, much different than it was last night when fire crews were battling the blaze. It's mostly construction and center point crews working to fix some of the damage caused by those intense flames. Crews have been at it since early this morning. What remained of a charred Centerpoint Energy pickup and a few construction vehicles were loaded up and hauled away. Residents here able to go out and assess the damage. I mean, it was scary, but I mean, it looks like they've got it under control. Carol Labonte has lived here for about 11 years. She says a scene last night was a first, one she hopes to never have to relive. People really fearful running away with their dog and, um, um, the fire, the flames, you know, way up and, and continued booms. Many were evacuated last night. Home now, though, and keeping those injured in their prayers. Just prayers for this, but for her healing mentally and physically. I mean, it's just unimaginable. And last night, about 800 people were without power here in this neighborhood. We are told now that that power has been restored. Again, crews are still out here working and will be for quite some time. We are also told that emergency crews have been cleared from the scene and the investigation has been turned over to Centerpoint Energy. We have reached out to them about the investigation and when they might expect to wrap up here. We have not heard back from them as of news time this evening. Live in the Klein area, Bill Barajas, KPRC 2 News. Bill, thank you. People are